Hello, I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook group page. The, these instructions are for October 21st, 2013. Things change on Facebook quite often, so you may need to go to the Facebook Help Center or you can Google how to create a group. So from your home page, you go to Groups section on the left side of the menu and uh, click on Create Group. A window will appear where you'll be able to add a group name, add members, and select the privacy setting for your group, and then you click Create when you're done. And once the group is created, you'll be taken to the Groups page. To get started, you click the star at the top right of the page and select Edit Group Settings. From here, you can add a group description, tags, set a group email address, add a group picture, and manage members. Okay, so let's do that. We go to Facebook. And we look down here on the side. You may need to scroll down, and it says Create a Group. Okay, the group name. Okay, and you could probably add your members right here as well if you have um, a list of the students. So you have, you can, uh, if you if you click on open, that means anybody can see the group who's in it and what members post, and we shouldn't do that. So we want to either close or click on closed or secret. So a closed is anyone can see the group and who's in it, only members see the posts, or only members see the group, who's in it, and what members post. So um, I'm going to choose closed. You could choose either one for what you want to do. Oh, it wants me to add some friends, so I will add a friend here. And then click create. I'm not going to choose an icon, but you can if you want. And now, if you look down here, we now have the group listed. Okay, Click on that group, and to add people, you can invite by email, or you can add their name to the group if they're already your Facebook friends. If they're not your Facebook friends, you will need to invite them by email. And if you go to the About page, you can see who the members are. Okay, and then um, you can look around to see how to change the the settings. So edit group settings. I just clicked on the star. Any member can add or approve members. No, <laughs> you want to click on any member can add members but an admin must approve them. You are the administrator. And then if you want to click uh, set up a group address or a group name, you can do that. Put that in. Anything else you want to tag, you want to, you can have only members can post in this group or if you want to check what they post first before it actually goes on the group, you can click only administrators can post to the group. Um, uh, actually, no. This is only members can post to this group or only administrators can post to the group. So we want the members to post. But if you want to approve the posts first, see them before they go on the group, then you can click all group posts must be approved by the administrator. So when the students do homework and post on it, you can see it before it actually goes up to the rest of the class. That might be a good idea. So we can save that. And that's our, that's how you set up a Facebook closed group for your class. Okay, good luck.